But at this point, I'm just want to max out my fighters and my paladin. So I'm going to get another paladin here. So that's three melee now. I actually like that. I want... I want more blocking. It's like we're building up a football team here. I want more blocking for my Ghostbusters here so that they can do their thing in peace. And I do actually like this positioning right now. Let's go. Let's do a smite right away. Right about here. Recovery. Oh, don't go charging up there, man. Don't leave your team behind. I think we lost two, though. Smite. We're fine. We're fine. More active recovery for you. What? Okay. Good. Good fight. Good fight. All right, welcome everyone into DNB Man Plays Indies. We're checking out Underboard Omen. This is a roguelike auto battler, a new game by the guys over at Headless, good friends of the channel. They're also the guys behind Ultra LMAD, a roguelike deck builder that's free to play. So go check that out while you're at it. This game is set to come out sometime in 2023, but I'm playing this again for free over at itch.io. And it's also available in another platform that I'm not too familiar with, but I'm going to leave links in the description on where you can find this game and play it again for free i don't know yet if the steam release for underboard omen is going to come with the price all i know is that i love myself a good auto battler and this is a good one to play over at itch so in we shall go okay pretty simple enough we start by picking one character and you can see that these are actually there's actually two similar characters here we have two asylum patients and a football player but you can see over here they're they have classes this is going to be a barbarian a fighter and a paladin both the asylum patient and the football player are melee characters though so we just want to choose between their um uh what do you call this their uh abilities here so uh, barbarian starts with punishment so over the course of the battle they're going to fill up on mana and once their mana bar gets filled up they do their um ability here for the asylum patient we have the punishment which is 60 magic damage and gain evasion which is dodge chance okay the fighter does delirium it's a bit uh more costly with 125 mana it gives us restless haste and stress hmm okay attack speed mana regeneration okay okay the paladin on the other hand ah heals okay mm. Ooh, but it the uh the comeback ability covers an area of effect affecting allies as well regeneration and cleanse i think i'm gonna go with the paladin here i've played around already with the uh the, uh, the barbarian and the, the fighter i'm gonna go with the paladin for a change here so this is our board and we can place our uh, paladin here over in any of the blue tiles and you can see his range here his attack range is only one a melee character so let's get this combat started we can speed this up a bit it's a good thing so you can see the blue bar um filling up there and there you go he, he just um used the ability on himself since we don't have any allies right now now we get to choose an item so after every combat scenario you get to um it's either an item a spell or another character let's see what items we get now gain paladin Ooh, mana burn on attack, mana regeneration, 20 physical resistance. So, I'm no expert, but as much as possible, I want to be building as many similar characters as possible here. So for the Paladin, let's get let's see what the boost is going to be. For two characters, we're going to get plus three mana burn on attack. So, and I think mana burn is going to be... We're going to eat up the, the mana of the opponent, which is very useful because we don't want them to be using their abilities on us. So I'm going to pick up the uh, Paladin's Chalice right here, which we can't use on this guy because he's already a Paladin. But when we get another character later on, we can use that to convert them into a Paladin. And then we can get this buff here of 3 Mana Burn on attack. Um, Okay. I did not get to see what the uh, the opponent's ability is. Uh, let's hope... Yeah. Okay, good, 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 good. I was hoping for a new character here. We have uh, the Ghost Bust. Oh! He actually is named the Ghostbuster. I was gonna call him a Ghostbuster because he looks like one, but apparently they all they named it a Ghostbuster as well. Good touch, guys. <laughs> so this one is a wizard. Ability is energize. 
this is a support character i mean aside from doing damage to enemies another support character shoots a projectile gives them resistant resistance is for five seconds mm, could be could be good since we have a healing maybe we could add resistance to that ranger let's see what the druid is all about area of effect for allies as well shield absorbs damage before health decaying at five percent Ooh, i think i like this one but we're gonna have two melee characters if that's the case how is the movement speed? 0.6 for this guy. We can press space. 0.6 also. This guy is slower. The ranger is evasion. I'm not interested in the evasion. I mean the ranger right here. So it's either going to be this guy. They can do both their um, shield haste. And this guy does the regeneration. Or do I do the wizard here? I'm going to try starting with two melee characters here. And then I'm going to give this guy the... Um, the Paladin's Chalice, that's not going to take out his Druid label. Instead, that's going to make him a, both a Druid and a Paladin. So you can see here, we now have a Druid and then two Paladins. Now we get the buff here of three mana burn on attack. And my hope here is that these two guys are going to activate their um, abilities and affect each other at the same time. Oh, okay. That was too quick for us to see <laughs> if it was going to happen. Let's see what we get here. Physical resistance, maximum health gain wizard mm. i'm gonna keep it um we have paladin and druid i'm gonna keep it at those two maximum health is what you're gonna get when you get a lot of druids huh so i might go for this heart card here for a lot of um a lot of what do you call this health 320 for this guy 320 for this guy so we can now we need at least um three of these um experience potions to level up our characters here i am gonna level up my original og dude here it's gonna increase his stats you can see oh you can see it here plus 80 plus 8 to attack damage magic damage gets plus 18 good 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 and then i'm also so, he, so he's now at 400 health this guy's at 320 while you're not yet no, 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 no. I'm going to give this guy. I'm going to buff this guy up even more. Can we see the stats for this guy? Oh, we can. Plus 0.4 attack speed. That's all he has, though. This is a, a bush. <laughs> okay. Let's go. It's going to be an easy fight. If anything, I would want more movement speed for both my guys here. Did we get it? Critical chance, attack damage, magical resistance. Do we have something for magical resistance here? Not exactly. Okay, this guy has regeneration and cleanse. Hmm. 20 attack damage. I'm gonna get critical chance here. Again, I'm gonna give it to my um, OG dude over here. This is plus four mana regen. More movement speed for this guy, huh? Also, only one attack range. Okay, let's gang up on this guy. This guy's gonna be stronger. Gang up on you first. I wanna get... I think the druid... No, no, it's maximum health for the druid. Okay. We don't have spells yet. I'm really hoping we get some spells soon. Spells are a very fun addition to the gameplay here. Okay, we got two potions. We, get, we did get another spell. A new spell, I mean. Plus one monk. Wait a second. Active spells. Okay. Plus one sorcerer. What do we get here? Active recovery. Two combat uses. Health over time for five seconds and some dodge chance. Okay, but this... We have to target someone with this. So re health regen and dodge chance. Okay, we can use that. Ooh, this guy's loaded. Critical chance, physical resistance, and attack speed. Okay. Um, this is... You know what? I kind of want to balance out my health here. So I'm going to take this out. How do I take out the... Uh... There you go. And put that on you. So this guy is at 400 health. This guy is also at 400. Okay. Let's go. So whoever gets heavily damaged here first, I'm going to do the ability on... No one's no one's getting it, but I'm gonna do the, the ability anyways. 
Okay, we need... I want to add a ranged... Okay, we got an item though. I was saying I want to add a ranged character. Movement speed. Okay, let me see though. 0.6 movement speed, 0.6 movement speed. We shall level up this guy as well. So the next level up for the level 2 needs 6. Oh no, it needs 9? Oh wow, 9 to level it up again? Okay. Well, I'm going to level this one up. So we got two um, level 2 dudes. Uh-huh. Regen. This guy has the shield. Okay, I might actually might make the druid paladin my main character here just because i like his ability more the uh, the shield and the uh, the haste i mean they're both equally uh valuable to be honest okay now what do we need movement speed uh i want to get movement speed but the thing is one is gonna get left behind here so i'm not sure about that magic damage fighters gain shield on combat Ooh, two fighters gives you 60 starting shield. That actually sounds good. But we started with the druid and the paladin already. Fighters gain shield. I don't think it would be such a bad idea to add a fighter to... Let's say this one, the paladin here. He's gonna be a paladin... Right? He's gonna be a paladin fighter. I don't, I don't know if there's a limit to, like, how many um, classes he can take on. I'm gonna go for it. Let's find out, right? Druid Paladin, Paladin, Fight Ha. Can we? We can. Okay. Okay, what is this? Seventh fight out of, I think, ten for the first level here. This guy has 20 attack damage, attack speed, movement speed. Hmm... Hmm. Yeah. Our ability is regenerate. Okay. Whoa, regen. Let's go. And dodge chance. Okay, it's getting a bit sketchy for my liking. Okay, good. I want a ranged guy. Oh, these are paladins. These are paladins. I saw the, uh, the symbol right away. Four characters is... Plus four mana burn and 30% increased magical resistance. What is this one? A barbarian? Okay, I think I'm gonna get the long ranged one now. Discharge. This is a paladin who his ability is. Oh, I'm liking the music right now. I love the added vibes here. Okay, discharge gives burn magic damage over time for five. The cones. Okay. Ghostbuster, let's go. Mm hmm. What is this guy? 40 magic damage. Maximum health. Mm hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So you can see that this guy has the three range, the three block range, three. What do you call it? Checkerboard range. <laughs> I think that I would want to gang up on this dude right here first. It's always my strategy. I don't know if I'm right in what I'm doing here. Okay, let's do the evasion for this guy right away. I'm gonna wait. I think that was a good choice. Come on, man. Catch up here. Okay, one more time. I mean, we're pretty much done with the fight, but still. What is this? Smite. Ooh, decreased attack damage. Decreased magic damage. I like that. Plus one Barbarian. Plus one Wizard. Uh, uh, nah, I'm not gonna get Barbarian or Wizard. We have Fighter. Who did I give the Fighter to anyway? Is it my OG? Okay, I'm gonna get Smite here. Only one combat use. I think that this would... um, ugh, This would... Come in useful for when we uh, get to the boss here. Which is this guy up here up top you can see the the map we have okay smite only one use i wish we could have more uses for it mm, what do you have sir mana region physical maximum health okay mm. Mm. no i'm gonna stay right here 
Okay, let's go. Gang up on this guy. Regen. Do the smite. Good. Alright. Another, um... What is this one called, anyway? Active recovery. Okay, no problem. We can level up our Ghostbuster. Ooh, I like this. This is for the fighter, right? Two fighters get starting shield for... For everyone, I'm assuming. It's not just the fighters, right? Attack speed, sorcerer. Yeah, okay. Get the fighter's mask here. Here comes the boss. This, um... A farmer. <laughs> I thought all along this was a scarecrow. His um ability is harvest. Covers an area of effect. Deals a hundred magic damage and applies bleed. Burns twenty mana. Receive physical damage over time for five seconds. Okay. Um. What does he have? Magical resistance. Ooh. Okay. That's not gonna work well for this one for the burn. That's fine. Okay, we have it cornered right here. Um, wait a second. So the fighters gain the shield. I'm hoping that if I give this to him, that we all get 60 starting shield. Is there a way of telling where the shield is at? Let's level up our uh, Ghostbuster here. Let's not forget to do that. Okay, good. Feeling confident about this fight here. I'm actually gonna smite you right away, sir. Let's do active recovery here. Oh, good. We're not even gonna lose one character. Ooh, that is a good sign. I like it. It's a good sign. And another fighter here. But we get a liquid potion. Oh, I thought this was, this was gonna be for um for leveling up. Ego. Plus 25% mana refill after cast chance. I think I want to get the fighter's mask again. What else do we have here? Gold coin, movement speed, stagger. What is this? The rogue's knife. Gain rogue. Critical chance. Ah, it's nice that you can, um, there's a lot of classes and you can play around with um, the different classes here. So rogues are all about critting. I am going to get the fighter though. Starting mana. That could come in useful. Plus one short critical hit per moved position. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I like where this game is going. But I'm gonna get another fighter. Oh gosh, this looks menacing. Four enemies. Let's give you that. So we now have three. One more will give us 80 starting shield and 30% physical resistance. That will be huge if we get that. Uh, I'm gonna, again, gang up on this guy here. Go. Good. Oh, active recovery. I am gonna do a smite on you. Oh, don't go down, man. Don't go down. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, we're gonna lose the fight. We're gonna lose the fight. We're not. We're not. Okay. That was very sketchy, though. That was very sketchy. Okay. Okay, we made it. It's always tough after... Wait, what? Did we get it? How come it... Did we lose? Because it brought us back here, right? I think we lost. Yeah, I think we lost. How come? Okay, I'm not sure, but I like this position right here, so let's go. Good. Oh no, they went one on one. Good. Okay, everyone's still alive. So you can see the value of positioning here. Look at this. We ended up not losing a single character. Interesting. Oh, this guy's all blurred out. Druid. Ooh, Druid. Two characters gives us more maximum health. Okay, but another fighter, though. Ah, oh, we did not get a fighter. Okay. A Druid. Regen, regen again. Another football player. But the Ghostbuster is going to be 
of Paladin. Breach shoots a projectile to an enemy, gives them exposed. That's for more offense for us. But I think I'm going to go for the Druid here. Give us more maximum health and damage reduction. I mean, we got to lean on what we started with, right? Oh, Intimidate looks nice. Weak and might. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm going to go as much as I... Oh, but this is another Paladin, right? Ooh. Six gives you magical resistance. Oh, this is going to be tricky now. The question I think that will determine where I want to go here is, do I want another melee character or do I want to balance it out with another paladin? Maximum health and 10% damage reduction. No, 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 no. Just 40 maximum health. Hmm. Let's see here. This Baladin is going to be for magic resistance. Exposed sounds good though. I think we might need some offense at this point. Because everyone's uh, ability is all about regen, cleanse, shield. Okay, haste is a bit for... Uh, oh, and this guy has burn. Okay. All in with the Paladin. Let's go. Two Ghostbusters here. And we can actually level up this guy right away. I wonder if the leveling up, how we should do go about the leveling up here. If we should spread it out like I'm doing so, or if we need to like, you know, focus on one character and like level that dude up. Mm. I'm actually gonna do a different strategy here and start right here. Because this guy, his movement speed is 0.6. I think it's gonna take him a a while to get to our position burn this guy does the burn this guy does okay two melee and two backups let's go okay so far so good we're gonna lose this one football guy but we're fine we have four paladins now right Wait, what? Do we need to beat them twice now? I'm seeing that we do. I think we do, huh? Okay, let's go back up here. These guys are, are the ones who are going to take a while now to get up here. She'll be able to finish this guy, probably this guy before they get here. I think we need to beat them twice. I don't think we lost the fight a while ago in the uh, the first. Yeah, 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 yeah. We need to beat them twice. What are these knuckles here? Attack damage and critical multiplier. Reckless. Critical hits are lucky being rolled twice and choosing the best result. Interesting. Sharp scissors, critical multiplier, and attack speed. Ooh, that's nice. Okay. Mana. Ooh. And mana regen. I might give the mana to... Hmm. 75 mana cost. I might give the mana cost... Uh, the mana buff to this guy. One enemy. The breach just targets one enemy. Mm-hmm. Critical multiplier though. Attack speed. Mana regen. Yeah, I'm gonna give the magnifying lenses. Yeah, so that we can do the ex Whoa! Who is this guy now? Uh Bark. I'm gonna give the um the magnifying lenses to this guy. So that we can do the exposed a lot more. The bark does bleed, also does exposed. His range is only one. What is this apple looking thing here? Okay. Mm, a tricky looking fight. Okay. You know, the only thing I like about this game is not the only thing. I mean, like one thing I really like about this game is that if we end up losing, there's no like heaviness or whatever. You just get an and an immediate reset. 
You can re-strategize and all that. I'm gonna smite this guy. Okay, regen. That wasn't such a bad fight. We lost one. So we have to beat them twice now, huh? Yeah. There's like... You get half a block. A collection of rooms to beat for a reward at the end. Collect clear 10 to complete the current act. Okay, so this is the second act right now. So that was a good strategy right there. Let's go. One thing I liked about my strategy there was I've even... Um... I push these guys back even more. Let's go. Active recovery. I am gonna smite you. Oh, that guy's not gonna make it for active recovery. I'll give it to this guy. It's just... It's a good balance between you know, auto battler not having to think much of anything. Oh, we got another fight turn out! That was my wish. I was saying it's a good balance between... Oh, we got a druid as well. It's just a good balance between, you know, just auto battler and chilling, but also, like, working well with your spells and strategizing a bit with positioning. I love it. I love it. I love a good auto battler, man. Um, okay, fighter. Yeah, we have to take this so that we can get the starting shield and physical resistance. Physical resistance, though. Ah! I just realized... It's as if I meant it to happen. <laughs> no, no, I mean, I was watching this closely, but now it's coming together. We, we're gonna get both magical resistance and physical resistance when we get our football player here. Yes, I'm so glad I leaned towards the uh, the paladin a while ago. Eh, Druid is okay. I mean, I mean, it's okay that we have it. If we're, if we're gonna get another Druid. But I'm liking this right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Any range? These are. This is the only ranged one here. These are all melee guys. Okay. So with that, maybe let me do more. Uh, a bit more positioning here. Maybe I do. No, it's fine. It's fine. Let's go. I'm gonna push these guys back further here. I think. Go. Oh, not a good position for this guy. Smite you. Yep, finish that one. One is down. Okay. First fight down. Good. Mm. Yeah, okay. Let's do a smite on you, sir. The music is really coming on right now. It is playing well with the action. Action is ramping up. The music is ramping up. We got another fighter here. Yeah. What is six fighters going to give us? Wow, that's a lot of shield. This is for a mushroom, though. I thought it was going to be for uh, the druid. I think I want to do a team thing here because these items right here, you can give them to one character, right? I love the music. And look at the uh, the the break music here. It's like a commercial break. Let's chill for a second. Okay, max physical resistance and maximum health. Again, left shift left shift to toggle. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think I'd rather do a team building sort of thing here. Get another fighter here. Get us closer towards getting six fighters. So this guy's a fighter already. Okay, let's give it to this guy then. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. One more fighter until we get starting sh more starting shield and more physical resistance. Awesome. Hmm, let's start here at the bottom. Okay, I'll put you here. Action. <laughs> the starting shield, we're feeling it, man. We're feeling the starting shield right here. 
smite. It's coming up huge. They're getting their early attacks in, but it's not it's not doing much of an effect for us on us. Double coins, movement speed, okay. Hmm. Okay, go. Active recovery. Let's do a smite on you. Actually, a smite is an AoE spell. Okay, we lost one. That's fine. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, not bad. We're getting closer and closer into leveling up another character. Hey, we get another paladin. What is this? Ooh, more. This is a spell. It's gonna be a spell. What is this one? Plus one combat use. What? Plus one combat use to active spells. So like, we're gonna get three of these and two of these? Am I correct in thinking that? Shield, okay. Back range, nah, not so much. I'm choosing between these two. Another two active recoveries or this one. We get another paladin. Let me get this straight. It did! It worked! We get three uses and two smites. Now that is huge! That is huge, man. That's huge. Okay. It's a passive one, so we don't have to think about it. Uh-huh. Oh, we're gonna get spread thin here. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think I'm gonna smite someone right away here since we have two uses for it. Oh, snap. Am I losing someone? No, I'm not. We have good... Oh, yeah, I am. We have good shields. Okay, we lost. That was a waste of use. We might go down in this fight. Ah, oh, we lost two. Okay. Come on. You got this. Two on one. Okay, a bit of a sketchy positioning right there. And this one even looks trickier because they're all lined up. No one is ranged though, except for this one, right? One range, one, 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 one. Okay. So let's line you guys up here. Okay, let's go. Good. Smite is powerful, man. Just noticed it. Active recovery for that guy. Good. Okay. Good. Good. We're fine. We're fine. Ooh, getting close to leveling up here. We got a paladin! Ooh, another paladin! We're gonna get six. Magical resistance and mana burn on attack. I'm still not exactly sure what mana burn is. Uh, yeah, the druid looks good. But at this point, I'm just want to max out my fighters and my paladin. So I'm gonna get another paladin here. So that's three melee now. I actually like that. I want... I want more blocking. It's like we're building up a football team here. I want more blocking for my Ghostbusters here so that they can do their thing in peace. And I do actually like this positioning right now. Let's go. Let's do a smite right away. Right about here. Recovery. Oh, don't go charging up there, man. Don't leave your team behind. I think we lost two, though. Smite. We're fine. We're fine. More active recovery for you. What? Okay. Good. Good fight. Good fight. We have good blocking, good positioning. Go. Starting to be able, I'm starting to see how to use Smite better. Realizing now that it's an AoE spell and not a single target spell. <laughs> okay, I think we might lose this. Active recovery, why not? Okay, for you. Smite. Yeah, okay. I think I've been wasting the use of Smite for all this time. Woo, we get to level up someone. Now we hit multiple targets. Who do we level up now? 
level one. Oh, we still have a bunch of level ones. That's right. Wow, and we've made it this far, huh? I'm just gonna go balance out. I'm gonna go all team mode here. Level two for you. Level one for you, okay. Level two, two, two. Good. Everyone at level two. And then let's see. Uh, region, dodge chance, critical attack speed. Unable to act for one. I think I'm going to lean further into the mana here. Oh, but it's for dodge chance, huh? I wanted to give it to the guy with the glasses here. Who has starting mana and less skill cost. Or maybe I just give it for the burn. It's dodge. It's a weird combo, though. I mean... This would be good for a melee guy because we have the uh, the ranged ones behind. Attack damage, critical multiplier. Attack speed, critical chance. Execute. Attacks deal additional piercing damage to targets below 50%. Mm. Could be good. Could be good. Okay. I'm gonna give the gold skull. Let's see here. Attack damage 38. Everyone is the same one, right? Okay, I'm gonna give you the skull here, sir. Ooh, who is this guy now? <laughs> Tangle. Exude. Okay, looks scarier than he seems to be. Okay, let's go eliminate these guys right away. Yeah, let's go straight into the battle here. And then you guys can stay here and here. This is a good target for smiting. Let's get it ready. Let's go. There you go. Dodge chance. Gonna lose this guy here. Okay, smite. Okay, no problems. No problems. Got a good football team going here. Ooh. Okay, looks it, all I see here is a good target for smite. It's 100 per piercing damage, and then we get weak as well. That's such a good spell, man. Where are they? There you go. We're fine. We're fine. Okay, we're good. We might go until we finish Act 2. Finish two bosses, I'm hoping. Can we get another fighter, please? I think that's going to make us too strong if we get another fighter here. Uh, movement speed and dodge chance. Critical chance. Didn't I give the guy with a crit here? Oh, yeah. Let's get this guy critting. So remember, the guy with the red helmet has a lot of crit. Got to keep that in mind. Okay. Okay. Positioning here. Hmm. Ah, let's see. Smite. Right away. Active recovery. Smite. Well, the spells are really strong, man. Ooh. No, we're fine, we're fine. Got a Ghostbusters running here. Okay, good. Oh, this guy's gonna get so ganged up on. But then there's a lot waiting for us down there. Okay, go. Find a position to smite on these guys. Here we go. I think we lost a unit. Oh boy. We're spread out here, but we're fine. Get some crits going. Ooh, we actually are gonna lose this fight. Okay. Okay. This is round two, huh? Ooh, and they position it the same. Interesting. We got rid of this guy super fast a while ago, but I think we need to do some... Obviously, we need to do a bit of re repositioning here.
Okay. Guess you have some active recovery here, Mr. Crit. Come on, Mr. Crit, we need you. Wow, that was much better positioning. I did not expect that. So I guess we don't shy away from <laughs> from adversity here. Ooh, another spell. More active recovery. Harden. Harden is for targeted player. This one is a passive one. Increased magic damage. Nice music. Gain added dodge chance and increased magic damage for 5 seconds. Not feeling crazy about any of these spells. I'm not using up all the active recoveries. It's too the fight is too fast for us to be able to use all of that. Pardon sounds like a good choice for us. Maybe just to like preserve someone, but I think I want to get Sorcerer instead here. Sorcerer's Aptitude. We don't need this, the plus one Sorcerer, no, but... Ah, no, we need two Sorcerers for increased magic damage, so that's a no. Oh, and by the way, okay, never mind. We're gonna go to the next boss here. So... Harden. Okay. This is increased mag... I'm just gonna get Harden here. That's an R. Oh, he brought... So we got the farmer again, but he brought some goons with him. A bush. It's a ranged one. And a bark. Oh, there's more down here. Shoot. Okay. I hope this guy doesn't charge up there again. We'll see. He did charge up. That will screw us, man. That will screw us. That will, like, get this fight screwed for us. Yeah, it did. It did. Okay. His charging there screwed us. Okay. So, given that, let's apply what we learned from the previous fight. We're in... Uh, now my, my concern is this guy's gonna charge down here. What is 0 for 2? Oh, combat, you must beat clear the current stage. Got it. Okay. Let's try this one. It, the smite doesn't work on the farmer, on the scarecrow here. Let's harden you even more. Is this going to prevent again? It did not. Okay, good. Oh, gosh. We lost that one. Oh, okay, we're going down again, fortunately. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. Because this is a ranged guy here. Uh, four. One, two, three, four. Try, I'm going to try something here. Okay. And then I'm gonna use Smite. Okay, let's see here. Now. Now we use Smite. Hmm, not good. Okay. Nah, no, not good. We somehow have to find a way. Okay, we need to find a way to get rid of his minions as fast as possible. The farmer is not too bad. It's, the farmer is actually not too bad. Um, okay. We need to get them in a good smiting position here. Not like this, though. 
And then let's get you dodge chance immediately. Let's harden you. Okay. Mm-hmm. Not good still. Okay. Oh, boy. The good thing we have... We got instant resets. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Why don't I gang up on these two here? No, no, no. Maybe I'll need to spread these out, these guys out a bit. Um, let's do. This guy does the burn, right? This guy does the burn. This guy does the exposed. Okay, you come here with us. Try this. Let's try two and two here. And then smite. Okay, we got these two here. Good. Okay, that's better. There you go. Much better. Okay, now we're spread thin though. Harden, dodge, and then smite. Did we get it? And still no. Close enough though. Oh, we lost! Oh, I thought we had unlimited tries! <gasps> no! Okay, we're back in the um the main screen here. Unfortunately, we did not get the win on the second act. I really I, I know I was strong enough to be that second boss there, but I guess it goes to show that there's more to the game with regards to positioning, you know, strategizing when to use your spells, how to use your spells, and I absolutely like that. We mainly explored only two classes here, which was the paladins and the fighters, but like I said, this is a free game right now. I don't know how long it's going to stay free, but it is an amazing and fun auto battler. So, so uh, check the links in the description on where you can find the game. I'll leave um, some links as well about the devs. Please leave a like in the video if you enjoyed it. It really helps the channel out. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the game. Stay tuned for more and please do consider subscribing. I will see you guys in the next one.